Welcome to the fort. Perhaps I'm a bit OCD, but I would like to introduce you to my power armor collection. We'll start here at the main entrance. Nothing new to report. Get our power supply in the background there in the glass room. In front here is a series of boss uniforms, Brotherhood of Steel, with the badging on the arms giving the rank for that particular suit of armor. And there are, I don't know how many there are, one, two, three, four, eight different levels of BOS adornment. Here's part of my collection up above us there. I've got various little themes throughout the park. There's another set of boss collection, lower level in front there. These are just random power armors, 45s. 51s, 60s, Raider. Along this back wall, lower level, are my XO1s. And I think there's 14 of them nowadays. I don't know. You can count them as we go along. But I've got the XO1s featured down here low, behind the rails. Don't like anyone climbing in and taking for a test drive. I convert a lot of this fort from like sales booths, marble tracks, I had a disco room with a flashing floor all over the place and it all became armor. The Galleria here is all but empty upstairs. Used to feature all the different paint schemes but more and more have a, become available so they don't all fit on there anymore. Let me get you up to a higher level, give you a better idea of what I've got going on here. I have not taken a count recently. My last accurate count had me at, oh, I think, 1,300 sets of armor. I think I'm up to about 1,500 now, maybe even a little bit more. And once again, these are all just random, random levels random paint schemes. This high structure to our, the center left, the armor facing away from us, all tend to have that kind of monochromatic brown or gray scheme. That's all Brotherhood of Steel. And the armor on my left side of that is just random colorful ones like we got here. You can see across the way there, a four level scaffolding all with armor on it. Multiple rows of armor through here. I'm in the process of filling up the perimeter all the way around the castle. Still have some empty walls over here that I need to fill in. If the movement seems a little jerky, maybe a little bouncy, is because we are pushing the limits of the memory for this for this game and it has a hard time doing all of the processing as quickly as we're used to in like a battle situation. If I leave this building and go exploring I get back to normal operations. But while I'm in here it's processing a whole lot of information and it just drags it down a tiny bit. So we'll stay on this level, scoot you on across. So get some blank rails here to fill in. And we'll come on down. This is all worth of steel. Oh, I'm sorry. This is my Atom Cat on the right. And then I've got the Raider on the left here. I'm sorry, I was thinking of a different location within my fort here. And here's where we started. So let me take us back up. And we'll take the elevator up and get an overhead view of what I've got going on here.
the room to the right there houses the electronic boss from the Nuka world as well as hard to get one of a kind weapons and things. All right, let's go on up to level four. And we'll go up to level four one more time. At this elevation, we are, uh, are above the level where I can do any further building. And the only reason that we can get up to this point is because this elevator was a pre-constructed four-story component. So we are a full two stories above the highest level where I can build. And that highest level is right there. So this is the highest I can build at in the game. So my top row power armor is all the way across there. They're the highest structures that I have. So that's my power armor collection. And it's about 1,500 suits of armor or so in size. So I hope you enjoyed it. It's still getting larger and larger. But for the moment, this is where we're at. So this was done with a vanilla game with only some mild enhancements. I've got the Busty app for the women. I've got better water, better lighting. I've included new paint schemes for the power armor. And that's about it. Um, I don't have any cheats built in. That will give me unlimited building capability or anything like that. I've built all this within the restrictions of the vanilla, vanilla game. So I hope you enjoyed. Take care. Once again, about 1,500 suits. My name is Ron Liker, and I'll be back with more in the future. Take care. Bye-bye.